one is that thing which very I have a some sort of bronzer or sleeve you and then it says like I received this bronzer in September from my very good friend who knew what I like and who wanted to wish me success on YouTube by doing so and guess what success has come so thanks you knew what you were doing <laughs> I just adore this I knew I would adore it when I was lemming for it and trying to find the courage to spend so much money for it but I know even more now because I've been using it since September. I'm gonna let you see how I apply this and then we'll go on with my review. As you can see from so much use, I made quite a dent into it and you can't read the Tom Ford logo anymore. That means love. That means it did not stay on my vanity. It means I actually used it. So this has very fine gold glitter. If you look at the pan, but when you swatch it on the hand, you don't see any more of that. barely there. Well, those glitters are there for a purpose. They sculpt the face. They add dimension. They don't turn you into a disco ball. Never imagine that because that is not true. I don't do so much sculpting or bronzing. I just swipe a couple of times and that's enough for me. I don't need a makeup look that takes two hours to make. Half an hour is enough for me. And that's where this bronzer comes in very handy. It does what it's supposed to do and it stays put for 8, 10, 12 hours. It will still be on at the end of the day. It does not seep into the skin. It does not dissolve with the other makeup. It just stays there. The color is very nice for us fair skin girls as you can see I think that darker girls would need something darker this would be too light for them I like the packaging it's glorious because you know in a luxury product you're also paying for the packaging and for the ads Tom Ford gold dust it is like gold to me I will keep using it and reusing it because it's absolutely amazing powder is fine, it stays on, the color is brilliant, it's not too shimmery, so I can layer it with other products, I can use other more shimmery products on top of it, it is ideal. I guess I could also use it as an eyeshadow on top of my lips. The only thing I would say, it is quite prone to fallout, whenever I pick up some of it on the brush, 
it does fall all around the packaging like this. Yeah, so it can get a bit powdery. I never traveled with it yet, just once when I got it. So I would really put this in its protective case because I'm afraid this is very delicate and that it would go on my shape or my hand. I am working my way to finishing it and when I finish it my reward will be buying the big size and the two inch higher. So this is my review. I give this product a 5 out of 5. It is a luxury product. You don't need it but it's very nice to have it and it sure makes a beautiful addition to any makeup look. Well, I hope that you enjoyed this video and that you'll give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel before you go. Bye for now.